In this tutorial, we're going to be looking at how to add uh, some simple sounds to your uh, game. Uh, sound effects are actually quite hard to come across sometimes. Um, so I found this website, which is great for creating kind of retro uh, 1980s sounds, uh, and I think they're awesome. Um, this is going to be my sound effect for um, uh, collecting something. Okay, so obviously you can play around with it. Um, there's loads of options on this website. Uh, the website is uh, www.bfxr.net. Um, and it's a great way to get sound effects. So I'm going to uh, export this as a WAV file, and it's going to ask me to save it. And I'm going to save this in my download folder, and I'm going to call it Pickup. That'll be fine. I'll leave it at that. Now that I've done that, I'm going to go to Game Maker, and I'm going to go to my player again. And I've already got the code uh, for collecting, so it's going to destroy the instant set score. And the next thing I need to do is add the sound effect. Now, in order to add the sound effect, I first of all need to load up the sound. And to do that, I need to click on Sounds here, uh, right-click and go to Create Sound as per normal. I can then um, load the sound up, which is in my uh, download folder. I can test it. And there it goes, it's working. Um, and I'm going to call this pickup. Then I will click on OK. And then, in order to get it to play uh, when the apple's been uh, picked up, I need to go to uh, main one. And you see this little um, sound section. I'm going to click the first one, which is play sounds. I'm going to drag it in. I'm going to choose the sound I've just uh, loaded up. And I'm simply going to click on OK. If I then play the game, you can see as I touch an apple, it plays the sound effect. And there we go.